And welcome back, everyone. In today's Crime Stopper Spotlight, we're talking about a couple of different incidents with Stacey Payne here. And Stacey, welcome back. Thank we appreciate you. you being here. Thank you. And we want to start here in Knoxville with a shooting incident that left a little boy hurt. And, you know, KPD really wanted us to be careful and clear that this could have been road rage, but right now it's unconfirmed. So tell Correct. us what we do know. Well, what we do know right now is a four-year-old ended up being shot in the leg. Yeah, and, yeah. and we wouldn't have found that out right away, but the mom took him to the ER right. at East Tennessee Children, and that's when you know they called us, and mom said, hey, we got in this incident. We don't know what's going on. It was around Bethel and McConnell Street, and this, you know, the little boy started complaining, my leg hurts, and they didn't know why. Wow, and, and so it, then they took him to the ER and obviously figured out why. There was blood coming from his leg, took him to the ER, and that's when they found out that he had been shot. Thank goodness. He is going to be okay, but this could have turned out tragically, much more so than just being shot and have a recovery. It could have ended in his death. So yeah. we are asking anyone and everyone out there, boy, if you have any information whatsoever, give us a call. Yeah. Let Crime Stoppers know. They, they, we believe it was a red or maroon four-door sedan, Great. possibly a Hyundai, but we just don't know. And we're just asking, if you were in that area, call. And that was really going to what I was going to bring up there, that car description. But again, they really aren't 100% sure. So they do need people to submit tips. Okay, so make sure you do that. Now we do want to move on here right. to this Sevierville incident. Um, you know, we got some information from police that you guys also shared on your page. This was a person who just really uh, needed a beer. Needed honestly. a beer. Needed 18 of them. Needed it looks 18. Like. Yeah. But right. Yeah. Again, the store was closed. He pulls in, it looks like a green Toyota Camry that he pulls up in, walks up, some great pictures at the City Park yeah. Market, pulls up, goes up to the door, pulls on the door, nothing, breaks the glass, enters the store, takes an 18-pack of the Modelo beer, and leaves. So, again, great pictures. If you have any information, submit a tip. You know, we'd like to pay you some money. Yeah, exactly. So you're seeing some of those photos here, okay? You'll also be able to see them online. Go take a good look at them. And real quickly before we go to break, how can people submit the tip for either of these cases? For in either these two cases or any of our cases, they can call us at Star Star Tips or 865-217-215-7165. <laughs> I think we say it too much. <laughs> yes. Or they can go online to our website or use our app, P3 Tips. Really, we make it simple. Very We're just simple. asking people to give us a call. Let us pay you some money. All right, Stacy. thank you so much. And thank of course, you. we have shared all this online at WATE.com. Go there, check it out, submit a tip. We're going to be right back after this quick break with a final look at your forecast.